It's something relatively new to Michigan, but today breweries are popping up everywhere. 20 years ago, it was uh, uh, not legal to have uh, microbreweries and brew pubs. We didn't have anything here in the state of Michigan which would encourage uh, the local producers to source locally. The effort to get breweries and wineries to buy local could be getting a boost, all thanks to the Michigan Farm to Glass bill. Even though the bill is only a week and a half old, it's already picking up steam, like from State Representative Wayne Schmidt. He asked me one simple question, is this good uh, for the businesses in my area, uh, the wineries and, and uh, microbreweries? And I said yes, and when he asked, is this good for uh, my local farmers, I said yes, and he said, where can I sign? The plan is to give tax credit to breweries if 20% of the hops used are grown in Michigan. Other alcoholic beverage producers will get the credit if 40% of crops from Michigan are used. I like the fact that, that this kind of initiative uh, kind of validates what's, my, what's really my gut philosophy, you know, which is to support my community. For the first 500,000 gallons produced, an eight cent tax credit will be available. And for every 14.5 million gallons after that, producers will see a four cent credit. We've been watching what's been happening, particularly in New York, where they have an active wine industry and a brewing industry and a small distillery industry, where that kind of tax relief was given for homegrown products. Uh, so it's time uh, to look at doing the same here in Michigan. Brendan Kinney. 7 and 4 News.